and cut you guys oh my god so i started doing my makeup i was like two minutes into the video not realizing that i was not recording because my sound was recording but my camera was not recording but you know what everything's fine this is why we can redo things and fix them and edit and cut so i got a new haircut let me just show you it's very like senora i got layers only on my front um section on the front section of my hair and then the back is all straight because i'm still i'm still trying to grow it out so i don't want to mess with it too much we're gonna put this hair back so it doesn't get in the way what i'm actually gonna start with i started doing my eyeshadow but i actually think i'm gonna be doing my eyebrows first just so i don't mess with the eyeshadow i don't know why i went straight to the eyeshadow i think i'm just excited for it but okay the goal is for my eyebrows to match that's the goal, but if we don't get there, that's fine. As long as they kind of look alike, we're okay with that too. I'm gonna start with some concealer. I'm gonna be using the Wood & Wild Ultimate Brow Micro Brow Pencil. And this is in the shade Deep Brown. So my sister gave me these four eye lookbooks and it comes with four of these. Um, this one is the Smoky Eye Look. This one is the Nude Eye Look, which is very loved very love and then this is the party look which is pretty new very much untouched and then this is the metallic eye look what i'm going to be doing today is the smoky one so i'm going to be going in with all of these shades and i'm going to actually start with this gray right here i'm just going to apply that on my eyelid blend it out up to my cut crease and we will move on from there so i'm going to be going in with this eye primer i'm in the shape two and i'm just gonna dab like a tiny drop on my eyelids i'm gonna be using the real techniques 421 brush i'm just gonna be tapping this in i'm gonna be moving on with the gray eyeshadow which is this one right here and i'm going to slowly build up my color in here just so it's very nice and blended Okay, now I'm going with a fluffy brush and I'm just going to bring that up to my cut crease and just blend that out. Okay, so this is going to be our base for the eyes. We're going to be adding more things later on as we continue to work on them. But for now, this is going to be the foundation. I'm going to be moving on with this black shade that's right here and I'm going to be adding that on my eyelids. I'm gonna go in with one of these little sponges. Okay, this is a little better. I'm gonna go back in with that gray shade and I'm just going to blend out my crease a little bit more just so everything can seem smooth. Dude, I really don't play a lot with cool tones or like smoky eye like this. This is how I practice. I literally, I feel like I practice my makeup more when I'm filming than in real life. You guys are watching me learn, technically. Now, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna grab my Maybelline Fit Me Loose Finish Powder. This is in the shade Light Medium. And I'm just gonna grab a different fluffy brush. I'm just gonna blend out the very last part of the gray shadow up to my brow bone so there's these two really pretty shimmers well there's yeah i think they're both shimmer there's this blue one oh my god this is so pretty i'm gonna put them on my lid that's what i'm gonna do so i'm gonna go in with this top a uh, darker one and I'm just going to go back in with this thing and I'm going to put it I'm gonna put it on my lid you guys that this is such a pretty shade let me just get close it looks so pretty in person like wow now I'm gonna go in with this blue one right here and I'm just gonna put it on the center of my lid 
I mean, I feel like it's adding a little hint of blue, but it's pretty subtle, but it's very pretty. We're gonna move on to the face makeup. Oh wait, before I do that, oh my god, I almost forgot. Before I do that, I'm gonna go with the Radiant Primer Serum from Neutrogena. Just so I can get a really nice, healthy looking glow. So now we can move on to the foundation. Oh my god, I was shaking it and this is open. Alright, so I'm gonna start from back here. Alright, we're gonna let that sit for a minute. We're gonna move on to the chin. Now that I'm not doing my eyeshadow, I feel like I can talk because I feel like I needed like a lot of concentration for that. I always have to remind myself to trust the process because I'd be out here looking crazy and I feel like it's not gonna look good. Me trying to calm myself down, be like, Jen, it's okay, you got this. Let me blend this side out because I feel I feel it drying. Perfect. Let me do a little bit. We love that. Not a lot of concealer because we don't need that much. I didn't mean to go this heavy handed, but now I gotta match it because we cannot not match it. It's okay though. Okay, now let's move on to the powder. Now let's do blush. I'm gonna be using the Glowing in Grace. Dude, do you guys remember this? I feel like I should throw this away because I feel like, well, it's old. But I mean, I don't know. I've been loving these two shades, by the way. So let's continue. We're gonna go back in to the eyes. We're gonna do our bottom waterline. I'm gonna grab that gray one that I went all over the whole eye. I'm gonna do eyeliner inside my waterline just to make it more. Ooh, should I do blue? Let's do blue. It's not that blue. But it's something. What do we think? Me too. We gotta get it darker. Yeah. I agree with your thinking. <gasps> you know what I just thought about? We're gonna get that really pretty blue in here. That's what we're doing. Yes! That's what we're doing. I'm gonna take an angle brush and I'm gonna dip into the black shadow and I'm just going to, I'm just gonna do this. And so there's this white shade right here. I'm gonna try to add that on top of that blue one that you can't really tell. I'm just gonna, I just wanna make it pop a little bit. Cute, cute, and my upper waterline. When you do this, either your bottom waterline or the upper waterline, you just gotta stay still. That's all there is to it. You just gotta stay still. I feel very glam with this look, not gonna lie. For lashes, I'm gonna be using the Ardell Professional. Lashes, this is in the style 575. Yeah, 575. I like these lashes a lot. They are natural but glam. Natural but glam. That's the thing here. Natural but glam.
Mm. I love me some chamomile tea. Yes. Especially when I'm on my period, which I am. It just, it's so soothing. Mm. And it makes me feel like a healthy person. So we are here for the tea. We're always here for the tea. Anyways, buy my tweezers. And let's get these lashes on, baby. We're gonna let that dry. We're gonna do the next eye. Oh, that rhyme, man. I didn't even need to. You guys, how are you feeling about this weather, though? About this weather change? I'm loving it. I honestly feel like I cannot wait for summer to be over. For some reason, I feel like this year, summer was just way too long. Maybe because I did way more than I usually do during the summer. Which is great. Love that for me. But at the same time, oh my god. He, ooh. I just cannot. I could not for all of those hot days. That was just, I just wanted it to be over. But I did have a lot of fun. Like, I feel like this summer was probably the funnest summer in a long, long, long time. And so, that's pretty cool. But I definitely appreciate that it's over now. This time of year is my favorite time of year. And uh, Halloween is when I met Tegan, which is now four years ago. It's just like very nostalgic. Is it ready? You ready? Oh, are you all right? You guys ready for this shit? Okay, and here are the lashes. This is what I mean when I say natural but glam. This is what I mean right here. And they're very lightweight, so I really, really like them. Dude, we're almost done. We're almost done. Okay, so for lips, I'm gonna grab the LA Colors in the color chocolate, as we all know by now. Okay, now I'm gonna be going in with another lip liner. This is the LA Colors Auto Lip Liner, and this is in the shade Mauve. Mm. So I have two options. I have the, this is a NARS. Do the letters are so tiny here. Like, how am I even going to read that? But this is just like a NARS lipstick. It's a topper. And you guys, this is so pretty. Nothing too dramatic. And then we have the Birds and Bees. This is the Showering Sunset Lip Oil. So the Lip Tinted Oil. Which you guys have seen me use before. So maybe instead of that, I'll do this one. Did you guys have seen me use it before? I don't know. Oh, a little bit came out. Let's just do, I'm going to do the top lip with this one. Oh, god dang. I was not supposed to do that. I'm dead. I'll do the bottom one with the NARS. Do you know what I mean? They're both so cute. I should have gone in with this one because I feel like this one is more lightweight than the lip oil. But it's okay. I just wanted to show you guys that they're both really pretty and there's nothing too dramatic. Like I said, they're both toppers. So yeah, and now let's take these things off. Why don't I have to talk like that? I don't know. I'm like the girl from The Grudge. Senora vibes, dude. I'm telling you. <laughs> uh, I'm dead. So, you guys, what do we think? This is a completed look. <laughs> I'm making fun of myself. Um, but yeah, this is the completed look. You guys, I feel like I did a really good job. I'm impressed. Good job, me. I want to thank me for my hard work, for my dedication, and my concentration. Because you guys saw me. <laughs> there was parts where I was like, no talking. I need to get the shadow. I'm dead. I don't know who I am. I'm hungry. So I'm not myself right now. So don't hold it against me. But anyways, I I really like it. This is the palette that I use. I tried to go to Sephora to see if I could find it and let you guys know uh, of the price. But I couldn't see it. And I know that this is a little bit old. So I don't know if this is like a discontinued... Um, collection or something like that these shadows are you know you can get them anywhere i would just follow the you know the light shade 
and then the dark one and then the little toppers and that for the inner corner and you're set that is it for today's video this is a little side note i just want to say thank you guys for watching my videos it really does mean a lot to me and i really appreciate it it makes me really happy so thank you guys from the bottom of my heart and don't be shy leave me a comment leave me a thumbs up anyways that's gonna be it for today's video thank you so much for watching okay i'll see you guys later bye This is me posing for you guys. <laughs> I'm dead.